Uh, what kind of something? Well... I can't come to yours. Not if Gabby's there. It wouldn't be right. Uh, forget her. Like, I want to take you on a proper date. Dinner or something. I can book a table. Can I let you know? Sure. Yeah. Uh, you're not having second thoughts, are you, about us? No. Paranoid. It's just... I've got the social worker coming and I don't need you here making the place a mess. Well, excuse me. <laughs> don't take it personally. It's not just you. Dad wants a pre-meeting pep talk, but I know what he's like. He'll come in, he'll chuck his boots everywhere, he'll want a buddy. So I've said we're doing it at the pub. I better go now, actually. Oh, well, actually, hold on. Um, I could bought this for Lucas. Well, I've not got him back yet. They might decide he's better off with Ted and Carol. Of course they won't. I've been here so many times before thinking I've got it right. I can't get my hopes up. Yeah. Well, look, I believe in you, OK? I wouldn't have got this otherwise, would I? <laughs> what is it? That's walkie-talkies. Used to have some when I was a kid. That's really sweet. So, um, you're gonna tell the social worker about your new, rich, sexy boyfriend then? Who said you were sexy? Well, I mean, look at that. <laughs> right, I'm gonna go before I say anything else is gonna make you wanna dump me. I think that's for the best. I'll see you later. Can't wait. Oh, and, um, good luck. Thanks. I know he's my son, but that boy is a constant disappointment. You don't really think you can have a future with Jamie, do you? Get out. I mean, you're not the sort of woman he'd normally look twice at. But that's the appeal. Something different. A bit of rough. Me? A bit of rough? You spent half your life behind bars. Maybe I should phone the police, organise a return trip. Oh, I don't think you'd want them here when social services come calling. I might wonder what you've been up to. I'll take my chances. I only want to speak to you. Nothing wrong with that. Well, most normal people knock and wait to be invited in. They don't spy on their son and his girlfriend. Oh, they do when they know the girlfriend is only after his money. <laughs> That's what women like you are always after. Women like me. Oh, I don't have to spell it out, do I? I know what you think of me, and I don't care, because it's Jamie's opinion that counts. He'll soon get bored. This won't last. What is wrong with you? You don't want him to be happy, do you? You just want to tell him what to do and control him. Well, that's not going to work anymore. You know, I can take him from you. I can have him whenever I want. So you should treat me with a bit of respect if you don't want to lose him. He'd never leave me. <laughs> well, should we find out? Now, get out before I drag you out by your hair.